Okay. All right. Last episode, he left off with uh, Connor being killed. Of course, he's going to come back. Um, on top of that, uh, he killed a civilian, which I probably shouldn't have not done. Um, also, Connor did kill somebody else, but I thought it was illogical because, man, you're attacking me. Like, what do you want me to do? But anyway, man, guys, welcome back to the channel. I don't even know. Uh, it's like, Mo, my decisions are not bad at all. It's just the fact that with this game, it's like every single decision you make, it literally generally affects something else that's going to happen. Like me killing the killing the civilian. Okay, yes, I got the word out, like broadcasting of the androids and our movement, but now everybody has like a negative, a negative opinion on me. And now I got to, uh, I don't even know, bro, but... We're going to see what's in store for this, today's gameplay. I don't know what's about to happen. Um, but let's go ahead and get straight to it, man. We've been playing together for a while now. I was wondering... Wondering what? Are we friends? <laughs> Show you how I did. Show you how I did. Ah. <laughs> okay, we're friends. We're, we, we friends. I agree. There's no reason a human and a machine can't be friends, right? I mean, I'm glad you said yes. Bro, she knows she want to be more than friend, bro. We, we, we already know this, but let's, let, let's see what's in store, man. Oh, God. Another Connor. Fuck. Damn, bro. You got a different tie and everything. Now let me go talk to old girl. What's her name? I forgot her name. Amanda, yup. Let me go talk to Amanda. Cause I'm, I, this is the second time I got this man Connor killed, bro. She about to get on my ass for good. All the time I didn't tell her, I'm gonna let you down, Amanda. Look where we at now. Was it RK800? Yup. Where's she at? Hello, oh, Connor. Right oh. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Oh, let's go on a cruise, man. Why am I rolling? Okay, you know what? Never mind. Man, she mad as fuck. She got the. She got that mean mug on her face. Trust it, okay. I love this place. Okay. Everything is so calm. Don't you to it, man. Just curse me out. Far like, from the noise yell at me. Do something. Ah, damn. Tell me. What have you discovered? I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hope to learn something, but I had to destroy them. Mm. Wait, isn't my whole mission is to destroy them, right? You seem lost, Connor. I am. Lost and perturbed. I'm gonna say trouble. Perturbed? No. No, of course not. Why would I be perturbed? What is perturbed? Why look at these words? Got the big ass words, bro. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. Bro. Oh, I know I will succeed. All I need is time. Okay, what is the point of my investigation now? Like, now I'm confused. Something's happening. What? Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Could you heard thunder, my man? Out. Okay. Whatever. Stratford. Why did you shoot me last night? <sighs> Who cares? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant. Oh, what about the investment? Oh, God. Hi, Hank. Oh, shit. What's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. 
You check the roof. Not yet. There's so much to look at. We have to make sure we check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Hmm. I mean, we know what happened. I don't know why I'm hmm. But I know exactly what happened. He's dead. Oh, God. Station employee. Damn. Fatal gunshot wound. Damn, my nigga Tom said, I'm sorry, bro. Shot through the back as he was trying to get away. One bullet straight through the heart from 50 feet. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. That, that, that isn't that far. Yeah, sharpshooter. It's in here, bro. Oh, this nigga, bro. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from yeah, we the know FBI. We know he is. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. Wait, is that the dude? Wait, who is this? What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Mm, he has a point. Whatever. If the FBI would take over the investigation, you soon be off the case. Well, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. <laughs> what? Don't fuck up my crap scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look that. around. Why well, do I gotta investigate? I already know what happened. Fuck it up. Okay. This okay. message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until, until we are free. That right there is. I didn't. Now you know. I didn't know who's gonna be that determined to say that. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. Marcus. I think that's RA9. Yeah, part of it. Deviants say RA9 will set them free. Mm. This android seems to have that objective. Something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. Mm. Hmm. I wish right there would have gave me the option to say yes, something or not. Because he kind of held back. Ah. I don't know. That's kind of interesting. Hmm. Inspect the broadcast. Nope. Let's get over here. Hmm. Each of us shot from here. Hmm. What else we got to infect? Come over here. I'm not going to talk to your ass. Your ass, baby. Come on. Check city. Hmm. This is our faces. Wait, bro, I just realized, bro, we did all this shit with no ski mask? Where our faces showing? Oh, yeah, we're, we're, we're done with. We're done with. Divine didn't break in. No, we did not break in. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. the station androids in the kitchen there's no evidence that they were involved but we didn't know what else to do with them you stored them in the kitchen bro go interrogate the goddamn androids all right man which one which one of y'all oh i don't know who is who which one of y'all you know you know all right let's do this do they blink look for a reaction to something spot deviant 
State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Mm -hmm. right. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Mm. What about you, sir? Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Mm. What about you? Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Mm. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. All right, Chris, here we go. Gotta figure this out. Why are you looking at me? Why, why, why are you looking at me? If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. You gotta be him. He was looking at me, bro. Bro, the one on the left, bro, he's still looking at, bro. He's the only one looking. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. I feel like it's him, bro. He's the only one that's like, look. Sorry. Oh, God. It's, it gotta be him. It gotta be him, bro. He's looking. It gotta be him, bro. You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! Torture? Ah, oh, God! Okay, bluff. The deviants have just been caught. Mm. They gave you up. Mm. There's no point in lying. It's him. It gotta be him. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Hey. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh no. What? Bro. Get it, get it, gotta get it. Yo, why are we starting off like this, bro? LB. X. Come on. Come on. LB. 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 RB. X. No. RB. LB. A. Is it because I, I didn't misclick, but I filled it to A and I stopped hitting the... Oh, my God. All right, let's go. Come on. Where'd everybody go? Let's go. Come on. Go. It's a deviant. Stop it. Uh. That's me. I gotta stay here. I gotta stay Bro, 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 bro. How many times am I gonna get Connor killed, bro? I knew it was him, bro, because he kept looking at me and making eye contact with me, bro. Right, where are we at?
find help. Okay, cool. Check the backyard. I'm gonna check this truck right here. Oh, look at that. Uh, let me go up here before I talk to that person. Alright, no, I just can't walk in. Okay. Hello? I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. Damn. Please? Any Please, help? I really need to see her. I'm Rose. What can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Come on. It's better if we talk inside. Okay, thank you. Wait, who, who told us about Rose? I mean, did I miss something? Oh, God. This is, this is not good. Do you think we can trust them? Yeah, we can. We don't have a choice. No. Okay, bro. These group of people, I feel like I can trust, bro. Come in. What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. She's exhausted. There's a spare room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam. Will you show them upstairs? Hmm. Well, go upstairs then. Five upstairs. I bet we go. Uh, okay, I'll trust them. Ain't no way they're gonna do us dirty like the other dude did. They seem like a peaceful, nice little family, I guess. All right, let's go in here. Okay, nice little bed. Little closet. Find them more. Need to put them damn clothes up. Let's hold out real quick. Can we like put her in, under the covers now? Like, yeah, tuck her in. I'm fine, Car. We can't stop because of me. We've got to get across the border. Mm, I'm not really sure. You need rest. You need rest. Get a good night's sleep, and we'll set off again tomorrow. I don't need Why do humans hate us? Shit, we I can't do know, anything bro. wrong. Shit. We're gonna be misunderstanding. It's, oh, it's, it's complicated. Humans are... Very complicated, I would complicated. say that. Sometimes it's difficult to understand them. Why can't we just talk to each other? I don't know. It's you I, and I, I, I can't even. I can't even. I'll be sincere. I don't know. I don't know, bruh. I don't even know. I really don't know. I don't know what you like, but I made you Rose's world-famous spaghetti. Mm. You'll be back on your feet in no time. Appreciate that. Oh, that's There's good. something for her fever. Thank you. You got some I'll cheese in that I'll get these washed and dried. Appreciate that. You got some cheese in that bit? Hey, yo, for those individuals that put sugar on their spaghetti, I'm sorry. You're disgusting. I don't care. I'm gonna I'm give, give something to eat, bro. You need to eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Yeah, she gotta eat something, bro. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Get some sleep. Tomorrow, you'll be stronger than I just you. hope and bro. I hope and pray that nothing happens, bro. 
I'll stay with her a while. Talking to boy. All right, then, yeah, you. I, how about you just stay up here and protect her, just in case anything happens, and I'll be outside. Uh, uh, that's the rules about the border. I'm Kara. Nice little place you got here, huh? This is my son, Adam. Hello, Adam. I'm Rose, but you know that already. Mm-hmm. Come and have a seat, Kara. All right, bet. Let us sit. Let's talk. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden, I felt like her life was more important than mine. Mm. I had to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Thank you for understanding. Mm. I'm gonna say why help. Why are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. Is she talking about too many people? We're not the first ones to come here. Mm. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on. So if, if the humans happening. help the deviants get away, do they also get in trouble? We've heard you help androids cross the border. Oh God. Can you help us? The only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. Mm. And after that android speech on TV, mm. everybody's oh, on edge. Yes. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Yeah, we gotta keep Please. moving. You've gotta help us. Because if she said that there's Rose, come quickly. What? Oh my god, no way. What's going on? What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. We escaped together. Uh. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. What will I do without her? R.P. man. Let them be. Yeah, let's leave them alone. Give them some time. Damn, bro. What are you doing downstairs? Get back in the bed. What are you doing? You should be resting. Luther, what are you doing? I wasn't sleepy. Oh my god. I need you to eat and go to sleep. One thing I want to know that spaghetti will put you to sleep. Take her outside, bro. It's okay. She didn't want to stay in her room any longer. Can you let her out? You all right, Kara? Yes. I'm fine. Yeah, did you eat your food, or is just going to sit on the dresser and get stinky? You can't hide them. Not after what those deviants did today. Did it's what? too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? Mm. We'll go to prison, Mom. Yeah, okay, I figured something will happen to them. Do you understand me? Prison! Adam! We've already talked about this. I, uh, no! 
I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? Mm. For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! Oh. They... They're nothing! Mm. And none of this would be happening if Dad was still here. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam! That's enough! Damn. I mean, he has a point. Can we talk, Adam? Really quickly? Please? Please? Come back? Okay, alright. What, what are we doing next, man? Check what's going on. Here, alright, bet. I'll leave, bro. You don't gotta kill. I'll leave. Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. It's been hard since his dad passed away. Oh. <sighs> but he's a fine boy. I'll go see about getting you across the border tonight. Okay. Thank you. You stay here. I won't be long. Oh god. Oh man. Alrighty. Now what? Let's look around. Let's look around in the kitchen. See if they got some more food for us. And the tea leaves. What's going on, man? World War Three. Oh god. Who would win in World War Three? Why is there an article about who would win? I'm not about to read this. I'm not about to read that thing, bro. What? I hope Rose gets back soon. Yeah, facts. Carol. What's up? There's something I need to tell you. What, bro? It's about Alice. Not now, Luther. No, I spill it. I, I want to hear it now. Oh my god. Carl, you being a little bit stubborn right now, bro. I mean, I, if it's about Alice, bro, we need to hear immediately. Ain't no, ain't no, ain't, ain't no time for waiting, bro. Oh. Mm, talk to Adam. Okay, bet. There is widespread shock following the android attack on Detroit's uh, Stratford Tower. The machines recorded a video message and broadcast. Damn, you know what I just realized, bro? So, like, like, okay, the whole situation with Connor thing. Although I made that announcement with Marcus, and like, of course, everybody's against me. Now it's like any android that kills a human being or does anything bad to a human being, it makes it even worse. Oh yeah, I probably should have never. Bro, that decision messes up. That's why I be saying like the, this, that decision specifically. It's like it, it changes everything. Like it, it, all the decisions, like bro. Um, I, this is gonna be a tough one to get out of. He described as demands on the city's public screens. It's still unclear whether these attacks can be explained by malfunctions or if some organization is behind mm. them. So far, Cyberlife has refused to comment, but we can expect more information in the following sure, blame him. Okay. The police. Oh, what? It's the police. Why are they here? What are we gonna do? Why don't I open the door? Uh, they know we're here. Wait, what, what, what does they do? Find evidence of deviance. Wait, what? Oh! Find evidence of deviance for left. Okay. Evidence of deviance. Here. Okay, man. We have to open the door. No, we don't. I knew this, this was right going to happen. Hide it. I knew it. Okay, where's all the evidence? Him. Hurry, Luther. Take Alice and hide. Uh, uh, okay. Hold on. Upstairs. Okay, one of these. Upstairs. Kitchen. Oh, the kitchen. Upstairs. 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 Come upstairs. on, Alice. Find evidence of demons were here. This. Is it this? Okay. I'm gonna calm him down. If they see you panicking, it's over. Oh shit. Do you want to get us into trouble? Do you want to get your mother into trouble? Why would I open the door? I'm not gonna open the door. And keep calm. 
Just do what I say. There's okay. But okay, there's one. Wait, is there one left? There's two left. Where, I don't know what the other ones are. Open it, fuck it. Good evening, ma'am. Sorry to disturb you. We've had reports of androids right, in the go, area. Here we, go, here we go. With all this deviant business going on, you can't be too careful. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Sure. May I come in? Of course. Oh, God. There's two pieces of evidence left. I don't know what they are. Evening, young man. Good evening. Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Fine, remaining. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. No, nothing in particular. Oh. Is anyone else in the house? Uh. There's. There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Do you have any androids here? No. There are no androids here. What other evidence do we have? I think that's all I can... Oh, guys. This is... Sit down, sir. Straight, right? There's no other evidence. It shouldn't be. Okay, so it's this letter S0. Okay, cool. What? Why did I 15? seems to have woken up yes can I, can I go upstairs real quick oh god I can't what's your name son a Adam M my name is Adam is everything all right Adam the the androids they he needs a rest He's been working in the garden all day. Garden? Why would you say garden? It's snowing. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? No. No. I, I, I haven't seen anything. This nigga looks so, he just looks so nervous, bro. Oh my god. He can't search upstairs. I better don't... go. Thank you. Thanks oh for the coffee. God. Have a nice evening. Thank you. Oh my god. Is somebody else in the house? Who's making noise, bro? Like he about to leave, bro. I closed the, I closed that door, bro. Oh God, I closed that door. It's nothing. The the washing machine. It's an old model. It makes a terrible racket. Sorry for the convenience. Oh my God, I'm so Good glad. I, yo, yo, why was the Good option? Why was the option a dog, bro? That was, dude. Oh my God. How would they come to here? Oh. He's gone. Oh, God. It's okay, Alice. We'll be safe now. It's Rose. Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. I bet. Oh, my God, dude. I thought we was done with, bro, because I swore I closed, bro, I swore I closed that door. Woo! Yeah, bro, if I would have got caught, bro, who knows what would have happened, bro.
Who knows, bruh? Alright, man. Back to Jericho. Our broadcast is all over the news. We got what we wanted. Now humans know. They took Marcus's message as a threat. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Violence is never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. Oh, They'll be watching us now. God, bro. Whatever we do next, we need to think about public opinion. Since our broadcast, more and more have been coming to Jericho. At least our message gave our people hope. Killing humans wasn't part of the plan. They kill our people every day. Do you think they agonize about it? That's no reason for us to become murderers. If killing is the price of freedom, I'll pay it gladly. Killing never freed anyone. It just leads to more hatred. You're too fond of humans, Josh. Maybe their lives matter to you more than ours. If you think murdering humans is gonna make us free, then you're as bad as they are. That's enough. I feel like that's a good, uh... And now what are we gonna do? I feel like that's a good argument. Like, I don't know, that's a tough one, man. That's a good argument, though. Because it, it, it There goes, are five cyber life stores across the country. It goes both ways. All selling us like merchandise. Mm -hmm. We're going to attack those stores oh, and set our people God. free. Attack stores? All right. Let's see what Look, happens. We've never done that before. They're probably protected. They have security systems. Not to mention police. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems, and we strike. Simultaneously at 2 a.m., no violence. Wow. Free our people, get them out of there before the police come. I'm here to chill out, bro. This is a night our people will remember. Mm -hmm. All right, bro, let's do this. I like these missions, bro. They're like, Marcus, bro. I've been waiting character. a long time for this. All right, ma'am, I'm gonna need you to slow down and like, you know, we're not gonna just be going on a killing spree. Okay, they're gone. Let's go. Come on. There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. Especially at nighttime, of course. Right, let's go. The store's over here. Mm, okay. So what's the? So we're just gonna break in and free him. That's all we're doing. How are we gonna break in? First of all. Is our alarm system? Pretty sure. That's what we are to them. Just merchandise on display in a shop window. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's 10 minutes until all our teams attack. 10 minutes? What are we waiting for? Good area. I'll get to the door. All right, let's do this. You see the alarm system? Of course. The camera's right there. Boom. Found it. Alarm there. Alarm identified. One's over there. One's down there. Okay, one's this way. Keep the store. One goes this way. Where do we start? I identified the security system. I think we'll be able to deactivate it. Just follow me. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. So that's all I gotta do. So that's what probably that lady gave me. Alright, let's do this. Alright, okay. I'm sure I probably hit some button and shit. Up. Oh. RB. LT. Mark, 
Marcus, watch out. What? I'm gonna hide. Now go, go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Come on, go. Nice job, Marcus. You see that? Oh, this is Nork? She changed your hair? What the fuck? Alright, come on, let's go, we gotta go. Surveillance drone. We need to get rid of it. How do we get rid it of it? It won't be easy to reach. Boom. Uh, drone patrol route calculated. Okay, cool. Too high. Okay, nope. Can't do that. Too, too far. Can't do that. Hmm. Too far. God damn. So where? Oh, the construction. How do I get up there, though? didn't have time to call the cops we'll soon find out there's traffic on the road we need to block it mm. it's one way it shouldn't be too difficult hmm. block that road. Yeah, we're gonna do that. Marcus Marcus come look look at what oh you're following we're in the same way Exactly what we need to ram the storm. Oh. Okay. Oh, I got eight minutes left. Fuck. Uh, what did I do? Block the road. How do I block the road? Okay, hold on. Talk to them? You're free now. RT. Oh, Cassie, okay, Cassie. Oh, oh. Should bother us now. Okay, secure area secured. All right, bet. Okay, let's go. Looks like the plaza's secure. Now we can get inside the store. I'm messing up. What are we waiting for? Y'all taking too long. Let's go, bro.
Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Give me a shot. Here we go. Handprint. Boom. RB. LB. I wonder what you'd do without me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Break that. Boom. Down. In. What's up? I got a driver, bro. Looks oh, like God. we're ready to make some noise. I do, golly. Is this plan gonna work? Bro? I don't know, man. Okay, we're in the truck. I knew we'd end up doing something fun. Bro, come on, yo, stop the, stop the talking, let's go. We're gonna ram into it, oh! Oh! I didn't think we were gonna ram into it. I thought we were gonna like... Okay. Oh, that worked. Get out, get out, come on. Oh, what's the angel? Okay, cool, I got you. Convert. You don't have to obey them. You're free. Here we go. Over here, come on. Boom. Convert. Talk to them, all of them? Oh, Here we go. What's he gonna say, bro? My name is Marcus. And just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. Well, we're doing too much From this right now. day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. Hey, well, three, six, six, you can good. take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now, sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them, or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. Mm. I'm with you. We're with you. I'll follow you, Marcus. I'm, I'm with you, Marcus. We're with you. So I'll follow you, Marcus. Now. We're with I'm with you. We're with you. There we go. Then follow me. Marcus, what are you doing? I'm gonna send the humans a message. Whoa, what are we doing, bro? What am I messaging humans? Not doing what? Pacifist or violent? They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. I'm gonna hack it. I'm not gonna destroy it. Rex. Right now I'm being passive this. What else can I destroy it? Here we go. Bus stop. Pack that shit. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our 
though. This one's tree light. Mm. Man, destroy that shit. Be afraid. Fear feeds hatred. I'll take hatred over indifference.
Wait. North. You all right? What happened? North. They killed them. They slaughtered them like animals. Who did? Who? Who? So lost. Yeah, make room, make room, make room. They oh. killed our people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. I'm gonna have a decision to do this. Oh God. Whoa. You don't have to do this. No. Please. No crime against an android shall go unpunished. Hey man, we, we gotta stand for it. We already, we already did all of this, bro. We done did all of this, we might as well stand where we at. It is what it is. Interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. This just in. At exactly 2 a.m., several Cyber Life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Numerous storefronts have been broken with cars vandalized and set alight, leaving many Detroit neighborhoods in chaos. Property was damaged and fires continue to rage in several down, major right? districts across the city. The bodies of two policemen patrolling the area were discovered near one of the Cyber Life stores. According to our sources, the two officers were executed with their own service weapons. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? Alrighty. See, now the only bad thing about this is how that decisions like that is going to affect all the other storylines. Like, the human turn, like, all of that, bro, that's just gonna make everything worse, bro, like, because we was already deep into it, bro, so I'm like, you know what, execute the ads, bro, I should've, I, nah, I'm not, I, I, I stand where I'm at, I, I stand where I'm at, it is what it is. Alright, we're back with Hank and Connor, man. Where are we at? Oh, yeah, I'm another version. That's right, because I died again. I forgot. Did I save you? Uh, can I get a thank you? I did save you, sir. Still immortal, huh, Connor? In a way. <laughs> you know, I was hoping you wouldn't come back. Damn. I'm just a machine replacing another machine, Lieutenant. You shouldn't get emotional about it. Mm. Fuck you. Why would you say that, Connor? Why would he say that? Chris, who's Chris? I heard Officer Miller was killed by deviants last night. My condolences, oh, yeah. Lieutenant. I didn't know him very well, but he seemed like a good person. He was executed in cold blood with his own service weapon. Oh, yeah. Just became a father three months uh, ago. Fuck, why did it to be him? Damn. I did not think about that. Just ready for now. Hi. Menu uh, screen. Um. Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Okay. Okay. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. 
Alrighty, wait for the android. Mmm, I got some water or some shit? What is this, art? Hmm. I'm assuming this is Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Hmm. Elijah Kamsky. Nice girl. Oh shit, I can read it. You're right. She's really pretty. Mm. Nice place. Guess androids haven't been a bad thing for everybody. You're about to meet your maker, Connor. How does it feel? Mm. I'll be distant. I don't know. I'll tell you when I see him. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. I'd have a couple of things I'd want to tell him. Let's see if I can analyze anything else. Hmm. Oh, what's over here? Elijah will see you now. Is this blood? What is this? Oh shit. We got the high. Uh, that's not that's shoddy. That's not shoddy. Mr. Kamsky? Uh, what are you yelling? God damn. Just a moment, please. Is that him over there? Clear. Hello. I get served. I'm Lieutenant Anderson. This is Connor. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating deviants. I know you left Cyberlife years ago, but I was hoping you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Hmm. Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Hmm. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Damn. You say like that, it's kind of messed up. We need to understand how androids become deviants. I mean, do I know, know. it's common sense to me personally. All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Mm. Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Oh, God. Whose side are you on? I'm on the human side, of course. Well, that's what you're programmed to say. Mm. But you. Oh, God. What do you really want? I don't want anything. I am a machine. Chloe? 
I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. The what? Your formality. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. It's very simple, you'll see. Magnificent, isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. Wait, is he an android or is he a flower that will never wither? What is it really? A piece of plastic containing a human? Or a living being? With a soul. Whoa. It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. Wow. <laughs> Destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. I feel like he's capping, bro. Or spare it. If you feel it's alive. But you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important to you, Connor? Uh, Your investigation or the life of this android? Uh, Decide who you are. An obedient machine. Or a living being. I'm not doing it, bro. I'm not shooting no more about no real, bro. With free Fuck the information, bro. I'm not shooting no That's more enough. people, bro. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell I'm you. I'm not doing it, bro. I'm not doing it. Nope. I'm not killing no more people, bro. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. I'm. I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. What? You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. Okay, but it doesn't make me a deviant. You're not, you're not my master. What are you talking about? A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Mm. Let's get out of here. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. Emergency exit. Ooh, wow. Now, here's the thing, right? Why didn't you shoot? Oh, now you want me to shoot? I just saw that girl's eyes, and I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. Fuck, I did say that. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. I'm sorry, okay? But then, weren't you the one that wanted me to leave, bro? You don't confuse me. Last time I shot somebody, you... Oh, maybe you did the right thing. Okay, all right. Oh, my God, I think it's confusing, bro. Bro, Hank is so damn confusing, right? Now, here's the thing about Connor, right? Why is it that I low-key? I low-key want Connor to turn to the other side, bro. Just to see what happens. Because, like... Whoa, okay, wait, wait. First of all, let's see what would have happened if... Whoa, there's a whole lot that would have happened. Spare clothes. What would have happened, bro? I don't know. Oh, I want to know. Damn, bro. I low-key... I'm, I'm, like, like low-key inside of me, bro. Because, like, here's, here's the thing, right? Connor keeps dying over and over and over again because he's... He, he's with the humans. He's for them. Like, he keeps dying... Because of that, like he was killed by another, he, he's been killed by androids what two or three times already because of the humans because he's with cyber like bro. Now that I think about it, bro, like maybe maybe Connor did not deserve this, bro. So I'm, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I probably should have shot her now that I think about it, but I just kept thinking like, bro, I, I like these past few gameplays, I just keep killing somebody over and over and over again. Oh man, it's good to see you again. I hope you will make the right decisions. 
I thought I did. Oh, I see now. It seems like this character screen is like she's interactive with my, with my decisions. Oh, huh. well, that, that's interesting. I kind of I like that. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to do it for this episode of Detroit Become a Human, man. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, man. The whole Deviant and the killing the two cops, bro. I, I just didn't want to kill nobody no more. But I guess that's probably what's going to have to come down to. Like I said, I'd rather, like, Connor low-key, like, turn on, like, the Jericho side. And, like, I low-key want him to do that. But I don't know. Because, like, we've come this far and did all this. But now it's making me realize a whole lot of other things. But... If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Feel free to comment below. And also, if you are new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. And uh, peace.